Hello, my friends, I'm Marcel and I'm back again, and today we're reviewing Peanuts Snoopy and Woodstock and Peanuts Charlie Brown. These are fake Lego sets from Mars Toy. You know I love Mars Toy, and let's get into the build. Okay, so we're done with the time lapse, and these characters just look amazing. I really like these sets, and now let's move on to them one at a time. First up, we'll do Charlie Brown. So Charlie Brown, he looks like, what's it called? Are they called Big Heads or something like that? There's, there's a Lego series about them that did, like, a bunch of different Block characters. Blockheads. <laughs> I'm not quite sure what they're called, but he kind of reminds me of that. He has a plain white race plate, a Charlie Brown little letter right here. You have the bottom of his shoes, his legs are kind of tiny, <laughs> his arms are also kind of tiny. He has this drawn-on stripe all the way around his body, he has a little tuft of hair on the back of his bald head. Why is he bald when he's like, I don't know, an eight-year-old, or, or younger than, I don't know. He's not a baby, and that's why he shouldn't be bald, in my opinion, but whatever. See, there's nice design on the curvature of his head, you have the nose, the eyes, the smile, the ears, and... In case you were wondering, Ted is empty. There's a pole in his head that sticks his nose onto his face. But other than that, there's nothing in here. The blockhead is just that, a blockhead. Of all the Charlie Browns in the world, he is the Charlie Brown, yes. I really like their design, and he definitely looks like Charlie Brown. And then last but not least, we have Snoopy on a beach. So in the background, you have a nice beach scene just kind of slides in and slides out between these two little plates down here. There is nice waves going up, although I don't think they'll be going like this in response to the plane's engine. You have an umbrella right here. You have a nice tree and some foliage, also some rocks back there. You have Woodstock sitting in an armchair with like life preservers as chair rest, arm rests. There's a little table with bananas on it. I love that banana piece, it's amazing. I wish Lego had a banana piece like that, like a, for a bunch of bananas. There's this clear pillar that holds up Snoopy's plane. Snoopy's plane is not his doghouse. I wish they made it his doghouse. That would have been really cool. But it is a nice yellow and green, and green fighter jet. There aren't any guns on it, but that I kind of expected that. There's a little star in the back on either side. And then you have Snoopy up there, and he's wearing his nice scarf. Snoopy is very cool. I really like how they designed, as how Marvel Story designed Snoopy. His legs can bend, his arms can bend, he can tilt his head. It's just, it, re it really is possible, and I really do like how they designed him. And Woodstock is also very cool. He does not move, but he looks much like Woodstock. He's a bit, I think he should have been a bit smaller in size comparison, but other than that, he's really cool. And he just sits in his armchair down here, if I can... Okay, I think I've caused too much collateral damage for the for this rep view. Alright, so I really like these Charlie Brown Lego sets. If you like Charlie Brown, are a long-time fan, or only just started watching Charlie Brown, I think this is a really amazing set. I wish Lego made them, but they probably don't have license to. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll catch you next one. Sayonara! Sayonara!